There may be times when you want to export your data into a Word document. For example, I have my sales and profit query opened up here and I'd like to export that to Word, a usable file of data that somebody can actually look at if they don't have access installed on their computer. To export it, just make sure you have it selected here, sales and profit query. Come up here on the external tab to the export group and click on the Word button. And by default, you see the extension .rtf, that's a rich text file. It's not .doc or .docx for the latest version of Word, which is 2007. It's a rich text file. But these rich text files can still be opened up in Microsoft Word. Now, I don't want to export this in my Documents folder, so I'll go ahead and click the Browse button. It's on my desktop. I want to export it to in my Exercises folder here. And then you can see the name down below is the default of the query, Sales Profit. .rtf. You can click on the drop down arrow, but it only gives you RTF. Click Save. So that's the address where it's pointing to when I click OK to export this. And I can open up the destination file after the export is complete by checking this, but I'll just go ahead and click OK. Do I want to save the export step? So that way, if I need to export more information to that same file, I can overwrite it and check this and quickly execute those steps by running my saved exports. And it's going to be named Export Sales Query Select Sales Profit. That's fine. I can change it if I don't like it, but I'll go ahead and click Save. It exported it to my Exercises folder on my desktop, which is minimized down below. Click on it to maximize it. And there it is, .rtf. Double click, it opens up in Microsoft Word 2007 and well couldn't fit it all there so as the table is getting pushed off over to the right hand side I may want to be able to change this from portrait to landscape give it more width here and scroll down it looks like it's taking up two pages thanks for watching hey as a quick reminder if you like my video please give it a thumbs up you can also click on me and subscribe to my channel get notified of the latest videos and for only two dollars a month you can have access to all my Microsoft Office training videos